I got out of the way in just the nick of time. Gosh darn it! Oh, I was just about to get rid of her, and then the whole gooey just took my credit for me. Darn it, gooey! I was just about to finish Flame Bird off, and you had to take my credit for me. Gosh darn it! Alright folks, welcome back to episode number 5 of season 6 in, of course, the Guest Star Heroes No Damage Run Through series. As we continue the rest of The Legend of Blade Knight with, of course, our homie Blade Knight. You guys may remember in the last episode that we just included Meta Knight as a brand new partner to the squad. However, he's only going to join us temporarily because I am going to ditch him after World 3, but that's besides the point. How World 3 turns out, since I failed embarrassingly foretold times in that last half of World 2 because it was pretty difficult. But let's see how World 3 turns out. Alright, let's get into it as we begin World 3. But we have to go through 5 total levels, so... This is going to get pretty complicated pretty fast. So let's start things off in World 3-1. And it's a good job that I got that, um... Zap Sword earlier from Wild Dude before replacing him with Meta Knight because I think if I'm not mistaken, you are required to have the Zap Sword for this particular occasion here, so. Yeah, this is where I have to be a little bit careful with uh, damage outputs because I could easily get hit if I'm not paying attention, which can happen sooner or later before the least. So. What are you guys doing? Yeah, I guess that kind of works. At least we didn't get hit, so. <laughs> Normally for this occasion, we would need Waddle do, but we have the Zap Sword, so we don't actually have to worry about that, because we're perfectly good and square since we have the Zap Sword. For this occasion here. Darn it, I thought it was far I thought it had a wide range and was able to get that, but nope. I will take that, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's continue, guys. Okay, so far we're not doing too bad. We're doing really good. Mm -hmm. Typically, we would have grabbed Chili, but that's not necessary. Bang, um, um. almost got hit. By the way, I don't know how Meta Knight was able to deflect those using his wings. That didn't make no sense. I will take that, thank you very much. We need that. We need to uh, increase our attack. Fine, Blade Knight, what are you doing? All those Scarfies almost hit me. Thank goodness I was able to outrun them, but they almost hit me. Almost. Okay, heck no, you got me messed up. Alright, on to our boss for World 3-1. Yep, it's these two again. Alright, con and con. Let's go ahead and do this. Already got the gecko? here, son. I just um, caught enough to deal with him here. Ironically, on the same playing field as his bro. Okay. Oh, shoot. Well, that's no problem. We can revive Gooey. Thankfully, we're not in a space where we um, could easily lose a partner because I remembered back in the, um, in the last episode that we did lose Gooey in that one failed attempt. So, we're definitely not losing him this time. But alright, Planet Con took it out, let's move on. Alright, onwards to World 3-2. Now, I think World 3-2 is going to be one of those levels that's going to give me a little bit of problems, so... I'm going to have to really focus for this next level, but hopefully everything goes by in a smooth, plain field. I hope. 
I was dealing with those. Got me messed up with that. Oh, great. Yes. Ain't dealing with no waddle these today. Ooh, combo game. King DDD. Man, he destroyed him, bro. He's low on HP, though. Thank goodness we can get a health recovery item. Alright, now on to this friend bridge segment. Of course, it's to have at least one partner, but we're perfectly good. But for real though, this shouldn't be that much of a problem, because this friend bridge segment is pretty easy, so it's not all that difficult. So really, we shouldn't have that much of a problem with this one. Woo! Almost screwed it up! Well, that required some teamwork. Let's move on, guys. Back in the story mode playthrough, I had to go through that door, but that's not the case anymore in the new um, Rehanded version. We'll take those, thank you. We need those. Oh, I just smacked that guy straight in the face with an impaling of my sword. All right, on to World 3-3 now. I think this is where we're going to face against Francisca, so... Get out of here with that. Get out of here, bro. Chris, what are you doing? Thank you. Booty, I was going to tell you, get rid of that thing already. Okay, we'll have to get rid of several of these electric saws here, so... First of all, deal with that... That two-face. Ain't nobody going to deal with that. Thank you. With these enemies. Come on, brother. Couldn't hit that Scarpy. Or that well that can hit that guy, so. Gosh darn it, I thought I hit all the two faces. Well, good thing Gooey handled that last one. I don't even know why I didn't, how I didn't hit that last guy. What the heck, bro? Oh, I'm in not a good spot right now. Okay, that works. I don't know how that makes sense, but I mean, I'll take it. Alright, let's deal with these dribblies here. I'm not gonna hit that guy. Come on, bro. There we go. Ooh, ice curling on him. Okay. I see y'all. Alright, let's increase our attack. Alright, so far we're on a pretty good streak. I'm surprised we didn't get hit yet. But I'm not counting chickens, because I know what happens when you count chickens. You end up making a dumb mistake and get hit. Actually, none of these guys have any of our concern, because I already have a full-fledged team. All right, let's move on to the boss. Let's go. Oh, great. Francisca is back. Okay, thankfully Francisca shouldn't really be that much of a problem, so... We should be able to deal with her painlessly. Smooth. Let's go. Dodging those crystals. Oh, that's messed up with that. Not getting hit by any of that. I'm messed up. I don't even know how I didn't even get hit. off. Darn it, I was just about to finish, um, what's her name, Francisca off, and then Gooey took the credit for me. It's okay. At least we defeated the boss, so. Alright, on to World 3-4 now. Now, I remember this level giving me a little bit of trouble in the past, so this is one of those levels I'm going to have to really focus on, because a Jammer Jab or Bomber could come out of nowhere and hit me right in the face, so I'll have to be very mindful and careful of that. I almost got hit there, but thankfully I got out of the way, so that's how I was paying attention. Don't mess any of this up. Come on, bro. Let me pull the right between. There we go. Not bad. I thought I aimed that a little too early. I don't know how I was able to get past that, but okay then. Deal with all those guys. 
Thank you, we'll take that. We'll take that health gauge. All right, time for World 3-5 now. I think World 3-5 is going to be one of those levels that's going to give me a lot of problems. So, thankfully if I'm focused, I won't get hit. Where is that? I messed up with that. I know you can technically get rid of those things too using the, um, the blizzard ability, but I just, you know, who needs that? We don't even need any of them. We're perfectly good. Sorry, I was going to try and keep my, my momentum, but I clearly could not. Alright, on to the next boss. Alright, next boss coming up. Flame Burge! Okay, Flame Burge should be pretty easy, so I shouldn't really have any problems with this. She tried getting us, but nope, she completely missed. Woo! I got out of the way in just the nick of time! Darn it! Oh, I was just about to get rid of her, and then the whole Gooey just took my credit for me. Darn it, Gooey! I was just about to finish Flame Burge off, and you had to take my credit for me. Gosh darn it! Well, that's okay. At least we were able to get to the first checkpoint of World 3 without taking a hit, so that's better than nothing. Okay, well, um, overall it didn't turn out as bad as I thought. I was actually expecting us to get hit one time, but surprisingly no damage. I will take it. All right, let me cut this. Okay, I... That was actually the first time I actually ran through that without taking a hit on my first take. Which is a bit unusual. Normally I would get hit at least once throughout that, but... That's actually the first time that I went through that whole thing without taking at least one hit on my first take. Which is... Pretty darn good, I have to say, because back then I... Got screwed on, on on those last few attempts because if you remember, I was not really too good during those last couple of attempts because I, <laughs> well, kind of got screwed over those last couple of attempts that I played. But thankfully this time I didn't really have any misfires this time, which I'm really proud of because in those previous four attempts, man, when I went through worlds one and two, those were pretty darn embarrassing. But at least I didn't get hit at least one time throughout those levels, so I'm proud of myself for that. Well, in any case, y'all, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It's been a lot of fun making this video. I'm actually kind of surprised that I didn't get hit one time throughout that whole thing, but... Hey, it's probably for the best, so you know what? I'm not even complaining whatsoever. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this episode. It's been a lot of fun making this video. I'll again see you guys next time when I, of course, come back for the next episode to tackle through some more of this game, and, of course, tackle the next half of World 3. Which I don't know how confident I'm going to be in that one. Gooey's going to keep taking my credit, but we'll see what happens. Till next time, y'all. Bye.